Hey guys, I'm Mikey back here from the video guys. Tomorrow we have an awesome promo in the game. And this, we don't know exactly the name of it at the moment, but based on what this looks like, this looks like Chef Low Stars. Uh, we had these last year with Rising Stars. Go ahead and take a look at what they look like real fast. We had these with Rising Stars last year, Chef Low Stars uh, in years past. And I'm guessing that's what this is. What this pretty much is, is young players that have pretty much only that big names are going to be getting cards in the game that you can use for chemistry purposes and also they usually have some really good hidden stats and especially because of the fact that these are no-name players it's always fun to play with them so with that in mind we'll probably be getting that in the game tomorrow morning uh and we'll also probably be getting one or two players per week just like normal what we got with the rising stars last year and of course with the chef low stars back in the day now back in the day with the chef low stars their stats were absolutely disgusting like there was just some hidden gems you could go for hoping ea does the same thing this time and actually goes ahead and have more hidden gems with these chef low stars but again very excited about that but other than that, guys, we have some instant information. We have uh, more information about the X Factors and Super Saw abilities. So real fast, we'll be looking at a spreadsheet in this video, kind of breaking it down, looking at how each thing goes. But real fast, we do have, I'm stop saying real fast. We do have um, the X Factor Super Saw abilities in salary cap mode and how much they cost to go ahead and have that. Of course, real fast, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and show you this and just scroll down here so very cool very awesome but again we do have a spreadsheet breaking this down now there's three different tiers to every super saw ability we have tier one tier two and tier three tier one unlocks at 80 tier two unlocks at 85 and tier three unlocks at 90. now this changes depending on the situation for certain players and again we're going to be looking at them in this video we have i think it's three or four um per uh per position so Three different types of quarterbacks, three different types of wide receivers, three different types of uh, halfbacks, tight ends, all that kind of good stuff. So let's go ahead and bring out the spreadsheet. You can see right here we have, what is this, four different types of quarterbacks. We have field general, improviser, scrambler, and strong arm. Four types of, uh, actually, three types of running backs, exclusive, elusive, power, and receiving. And we have, is this, four types of receivers, deep threat, physical, route running, and slot. And we have blocking, we have possession and vertical tight ends. So depending on what position, you know, you're looking at either quarterback, halfback, wide receiver, or tight end, because of different types of those players, like I've been saying, uh, I think I said all last year, you know, um, Delaney Walker for the Titans, amazing run blocker. He's a great tight end. But when it comes to vertical threat, I'd rather have George Kittle over Delaney Walker. But for run blocking purposes, I'd rather have Delaney Walker. And depending on what type of player you have at that position, would it dictate what ability you get in the game? So we'll go ahead and start off right away with talking about the different abilities. So we have Hot Route Master, Homer, Human Joystick, Identifier. And I'm going to go ahead and zoom in a little bit for you guys. to show you guys this a little bit better. So we have... Um, Identifier, in, out, elite, in, post, elite, in, specialist, in, door, baller, inside, dead eye, inside, zone, guru, jukebox, last ditch, leap, frog, lofting, uh, dead eye, long range, dead eye, matchup, nightmare, no lock, dead eye, out, corner, elite, outside, apprentice, outside, zone, guru, pass, lead, elite, pin, and pull, guru, playmaker, pocket, dead eye, Pocket lead, post a flag elite, um, post specialist, protected, quarterback playmaker, uh, running back apprentice, red eye, red zone, dead eye, red zone threat, roaming dead eye, um, route apprentice, route technician, safety valve, secure protector, set feet lead, sideline dead eye, slant specialist, sleight of hand uh, slot apprentice, slot omatic spin cycle and sp uh streak specialist tight end apprentice and wide receiver apprentice so a lot a lot of different type of abilities now of course depending on what you know type of quarterback you have a running back wide receiver you will unlock it at different times so for example looking at field general you can see uh, a a chord extender a cord extender does go ahead and unlock right here at tier three with 90 BOS. 
can't think on the top of my head what that is. But anyway, so at 90 for that stat, then tier 3 will unlock. Now, most of the tiers, I believe it's, again, 80, 85, 90. But depending on, you know, what the ability is, for example, Bulldozer doesn't unlock for Improviser Quarterback until the truck is at 90, or the 95 overall, or the truck's at 95. So it all depends on each single player. So real fast, we have Clutch, which of course unlocks at tier 1 for every single player position so that's actually just a typical thing that unlocks uh conductor unlocks at awareness of 88 for tier 2 for a field general quarterback but conductor does not unlock for improviser or scrambling quarterback it does unlock for a strong arm but only if it hits 95 overall and 95 awareness so if you guys do not hit those certain stats you're not able to go ahead and get these certain things now of course this is all for powering players up so this is not for you know going ahead and just adding to a random card but of course as you power up this these do unlock so going down here we have get wrapped which unlocks a tier 2 uh tier 1 tier 2 and tier 2 at the other quarterback positions um, Gunslinger, tier 3, 95 revolt or 95 throw power. Um, of course, the strong arm will unlock at tier 3, which will most likely be a 90 overall. Um, and of course, tier 3, a 95 overall or 95 throw power for improviser. But scrambling quarterback does not get gunslinger. Now, a lot of these do make sense. For example, a scrambling quarterback having gunslinger really wouldn't make sense uh, because they're scrambling. They're not going to go ahead and throw the ball as quick as humanly possible. Nonetheless, though, we have Gusty Scrambler, which of course tier two and tier uh, two tier twos for improviser and scrambler, but strong arm and field general does not go ahead and get that. Now identifier, um, scrambler gets at 95 awareness, while tier twos for 90 overall awareness for improviser and strong arm, and field general gets it at tier one. So kind of cool kind of interesting definitely a nice breakdown of all these single positions so let's go ahead and now go into the defense and same concept for the defense as we had for the offense nothing too specially different we have abilities and they unlock at certain abilities now as you can see real fast one stopper right here so let me go ahead and make this a little bit bigger for you guys um let's see um i should be able to do that there we go so we have tier 3 99 overall or 95 finesse move so again some of these are going to be a little bit, you know, more heavy when it comes to how to unlock it. You know, the overall is going to be a little bit higher than other things. So, kind of cool, kind of interesting, but under pressure, edge threat, pass rush elite, edge threat elite, finesse specialist, power specialist, reach elite, run stopper, homer, end all, end all baller, clutch, tip drill, acrobatic, lurker, zone out, Pick specialist, jukebox, spin move, a spin cycle, man up, universal coverage, unfakeable, skill tackler, enforcer, strip specialist, and tackle supreme. So very interesting. And right here, it actually goes ahead and breaks down a little bit more of the information. So again, this is on, I believe, on EA Sports' website. So you can look this and kind of go break down if you really want to uh, certain positions. If you are going ahead and going ahead and go, if you're going ahead and going for certain, you know, type of positions and certain uh, players in that position but real fast under pressure for example uh, for the runs run power rusher and speed rusher all three gets it but tier two tier one and tier one so all right so also real fast I'm going to go ahead and mention this is that just because the player is tier three that does not mean he automatically um doesn't mean the ability unlocks automatically meaning that you have to unlock it yourself obviously uh, which is very obvious in the last though. Let's go ahead and go to unfakeable tier one, tier two, tier two. Um, and let's see. So again, not every single player will unlock certain abilities. So tell me down below, guys, your thoughts and opinions of this. I don't know. I mean, it's really it's really in depth, I feel like. Definitely a lot more than last year. Now, last year we did have this. Don't get me wrong. Last year, for example, you know, certain quarterbacks like a Russell Wilson couldn't get a certain ability because he didn't hit the certain overall. And last year we had that for the Red Chems was in order to get them, you needed to hit a certain overall for that ability. So you need to hit like a 90 awareness, 90 throw power in order to get a gunslinger or something like that. So we've had this last year. We just haven't had 
as many different type at every single position. You know, we had like a quarterback, but we didn't have a quarterback that was a field general, improviser, scramble, and strong arm. This year, they're really going in depth and making sure you can tell the difference between these certain, you know, positions and these certain uh, types of quarterbacks or type of players in that certain position. So very excited to see this. I'm really actually looking forward to this year and see all the stuff they add to the game because it looks like they're really trying this year to really make this game a lot better. But thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe button. See you guys next one. Peace out.